Hi, we're Heavy Metal Beer Club. Welcome to today's show. And today we are drinking Freemason Golden Ale. And this comes from uh, Chandelure Island Brewing Company out of Gulfport, Mississippi. So this is going to be fun trying out something like this. It's a uh, 5% alcohol by volume. I like the name Chandelure. Like yeah. it's, it's like chandelier, but it's chandelure because there's a fish on it. Yeah, that's very cool. I like uh, their real. logo. The first pour, oh, thank you. being the gentleman that I am. Number one, who else is suffering from this heat and <laughs> really sick and tired to death of it? <laughs> I like it. it says right here, the easy drinking cream ale is brewed with a bit of corn, oats, and barley. All right, enjoy cold as you it should. Miss help. It sounds so healthy. That's a, a nice light colored golden ale, though, wouldn't you say? Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's, it's colored. Very clear. I'm gonna give it a smell. Give it a little sniffer. Oh, Ooh, it so good. yeah, it smells sweet. Yeah, it and smells malty. Fru yeah, fruity. Yeah, you get malty, you get fruity out of it. It smells so good. Yeah. Had a couple good golden ales lately. Yeah. The other yeah. one was at Casa uh, Beer. Oh, yeah, yeah, the 40th anniversary Gosh, beer. That was so good, too. And now this one. And reminds now me of this one. Sea. Compare it now. Yeah, it's very nice. You getting anything different out of the scent that I'm getting besides the fruity apple? It's got the um, smells really good. You got a better sniffer than I do, so that's why I have to put pretty um, the fruit notes on it. But it smells so good. Um, it smells like it's gonna taste good, and I can't wait to taste it. Oh yeah, that is really yeah. good. Yeah. It's mild, but yet um, very nice. I'm getting malty, lightly bready. Yeah, that's a good term, bready, because I'm tasting that as well. Kind of malty and bready. Slightly sweet. It reminds me of brew day when you go to a brewery and you can yeah. smell the malt when that's you go in there. That's exactly, it, it tastes like yeah, it brew tastes, day. Yeah, it tastes like but that. But it doesn't taste too sweet. It's just so good. A blue really day is like, a happy day for me. I like that scent when we go in there. We have to thank our next door neighbors for this, Clayton and Lisa. Yeah, thank, thank you. you very much. They uh, brought this back from Mississippi. Yes, this is very good. And uh, on the tasty meter, which is on the scale of one through five, what on would the you say? scale of one through five, I would give this a three point seven five. Wow, that's pretty funny because you would go lower. Uh, you're usually higher than me. I was going to go with a solid four on this one. Right. Well, there yeah. you. So there you have it, folks. Who else is suffering with this? He talk about it. Tell us about it. <laughs> Want me to tell you? Be, we'll be here a long time. <laughs> yeah. I'm waiting for the fall, as always. Yeah, as always. Now I'm sick of this heat. She but... starts dressing for fall when it's still 100 degrees here in Arizona. You just have to turn up their conditioners, then you look cooler. Yeah, and I'm freezing. Summer I'm in shorts and a t-shirt. So boring. Okay, so anyways, <laughs> cheers from your local Heavy Metal Beer Club. Thank you so much for joining us here at Heavy Metal Beer Club. Stay safe, drink responsibly, and stay, stay metal. metal. Ooh, look what just popped up. Oh, wow. Yeah, see, that's um, that one's good. The pumpkin beers when they start. Well, I hope out. that turned out okay. Yeah, I'm sure it did. Okay. Oh no. What? I'm kidding. Oh my.